Me, I went in the street because I was ignorant. I went in the street because I had lost my balance. And I had gone in the street because of an influence. So I came to find that, you know, I should not be influenced. This is set one year old Richard Soko, who spent 11 years on the streets begging to earn a living. But after realizing the evils of life on the streets, Richard left the streets to live a normal life, and now he lives a decent life in Kuku compound of Lusaka. So probably what I can adv uh, advise to the, those friends of mine who are still in the street is to tell them that it's very easy for them to reform. May they consider God to be their, their father, because man can disappoint them, but God cannot disappoint them. Meanwhile, Richard has urged political party leaders not to use youth as tools of political violence. He also urged whoever will be elected into office to prioritize youth empowerment if Zambia is to see more development. It's very unfortunate that people are being killed, innocent people, because of politics. So I'm telling these political leaders to urge their cadres to tell them that they should not influence other youths and influence the Zambians in terms of confusion. Richard stands out as an example of a young person who stood up against the evils of street life and his quest to empower others may help convince his fellow colleagues to rejoin society.